L'attaque, il est juste là pour te faire sortir à la fin. Et rien qu'avec le mouvement du corps. Quand tu as tourné ta tête, tu regardes bien la hanche. Et que si tu as tourné ton kayak, normalement, tu es déjà sorti. Voilà. Donc on pousse la pagaie très fort vers le fond avec la main gauche. Hein. Et donc on relâche totalement. Le, le bras doit être tendu. Voilà. Donc là on est cambré. Le bras gauche là, est totalement tendu. On pousse la pagaie vers le fond. Et, voilà. Et donc il faut laisser la pagaie flotter. Donc à une même, il y a même, théoriquement on peut ne peut même pas mettre l'autre la, main sur la pagaie. Mais surtout ne pas pousser avec l'autre main sur la pagaie. On l'arrête juste avec la main droite. Et donc le, le bras gauche l'attend so, le plus au fond possible. As the body is back, the tip is up. And I'm pressuring the, the very end closest to the bottom. Allez, vraiment chercher le fond. Now, go Sherry. Head drops, watch this hand. Donc là, à ce moment-là, on commence à tirer avec la jambe et on inverse, en main, enfin à peu près simultanément, on commence à tirer sur la jambe Now et on inverse la cambrure du dos. Have straight elbow. Ouais. Et donc à ce moment-là, les deux bras sont tendus et donc évidemment on relâche totalement la pression sur euh, la main sur laquelle il y a la pression et on pousse avec l'autre en gardant la tête. And now, using the paddle as a pry, You can push off it and rotate and pull through. Et donc après on utilise la pagaie comme un appui. Et donc là après troisième point important c'est de la tirer sur le pont. Donc de la tirer sur le pont. Up et ça, down, pull through. Donc un deux trois. Un la position de la vache. Deux on cambre, euh, on inverse le, la cambrure en tirant sur la jambe. Et trois on tire la pagaie, on tourne et on tire la bras même la pagaie sur la cambrure. Okay, c'est ça, oui. Sherry doesn't, I mean, she doesn't need that hand at this point. We engage the hand in step two when the head goes down, pressure the paddle. Et on retire sur le, sur la pagaie sur le bout. Okay. Reverse sweep. Rotate. A lot of people have this, okay. for sure. So let's just make sure you have a good entry. Take the paddle to the gunnel and make sure that upside down it stays there so that you know where you are to recover. Back to the boat, forward, perpendicular to recover. 
And then the whole roll is set. Arching the back and being patient. Let the head come up to the surface. Shoulder to the kayak. And swing. Okay, so I'm going to be face down. Face out float. So I'm turning the kayak as much as I can in my float. When it's almost right side up, my head is the deepest. Okay? Now I just need to get on the kayak and keep this forward armpit and go across the snake. So when I add the paddle, I want to do the same thing. I want to get as much out of that float as I can. I'm going to keep this arm straight. It's really hard to see what your hands are doing in the water because it's not clear. I want to talk about the boat moving from the float. So the boat moves when she drops her head and presses down on the paddle. Okay? Um, until, until you engage this outboard hand, you don't move the boat. You don't even want to have contact with the legs. Just let the boat go. Let it all go. Arch your head up and no load on the tip. Then load the tip and drive the leg. The boat should correct at, at least that much. Then you're well on your way to being home. So just move the kayak before your paddle. Then you won't hurt your shoulder. Okay. Mm -hmm. The second step is to keep the paddle tip up, rotate and tag your back gunnel. This Learning is where the reverse sweep is. sweep. Back with the paddle underneath you in the same position, then sweep forward and then load the paddle. Drive the head down with the leg up. You all get that? Head goes down, but the leg drives through. So you drive with the leg as you drive the head down. And then finally you pull the paddle in flat. People often stop right here and wonder what's going on. Complete that. And then the whole roll. You've been going back and forth and tagging. So that's kind of like your orientation point. Keep the paddle right there. Into the gunnel. Now you're at the tag from the other direction, from the forward direction. You should know where you are at that point and just finish. Can you show us all sweep? Ultimately, the roll should look something like this all sweep. Nice, smooth flow. Just start your leg at the tag. Okay, any questions on the reverse sweep? Anyone, yeah. <laughs> anyone else have any questions? Curling in, looking at my hip. Again, if you're working with someone, Don't let them go too forward too early. Go again. Okay, so forward, curling into the hip, try to stick your face. So try getting into the face down float. This arm is straight underneath you. And then flip the boat back and forth.
Okay. If you're having trouble not loading the paddle soon, we're going to have you take the hand right off. Okay. Then load, head drops, and then you can. Thank you.